A former rival comes to stage Saputo with wins in its sales. A big challenge awaits the Blue Blanc Noir this Saturday at 7 p.m. at Stade Saputo. Tickets, TVA Sports, TSN, 98, 5 FM. TSN Radio 690, the top team in the Western Conference, Sporting Kansas City, comes to Montreal following a spectacular remontada, last weekend against the Houston Dynamo, in the Blue Hell. Indeed, Peter Vermey's men, trailing 0-2 at the half, scored three goals with no response, including two in the game's last ten minutes, to come within two points of Atlanta United FC, who leads the way in the race to the supporters' shield. The league's best defense comes to Montreal on a nine-game streak of invincibility. But there are still glimmers of hope for the Blue Blanc Noir, SKC is much less convincing away from home, drawing games to Portland and Minnesota in that sequence, and Matt Beasler, the cornerstone of their defense, playing next to Aiko Kara, please note, and a veteran of the American national team, remains questionable, and may not make the trip with the rest of the representatives of Dr. Laurent Tavernay Tardif's adopted state. Here are the three keys to the game in what will be a hotter-than-usual Montreal. Discipline and positioning Sporting's passing game is among the league's best. Kansas is excellent at settling into the opponent's final third, keeping possession of the ball and finding open teammates. To counter this strategy, the Blue Blanc Noir's players will need to quickly apply pressure on the holder of the ball, all while being disciplined in their positioning to keep themselves close to every opposing player. Watch out for Daniel Saloy the young 21-year-old Hungarian is the star of the hour in MLS. The center forward scored a goal and added two assists in his team's comeback against the Dynamo and has accumulated five goals and six assists in 2018. Equally capable of striking dangerous curled shots from outside the 18-yard box as he is at being forgotten inside the box, SKC's number 20 is definitely someone the impact will need to keep an eye on. We're expecting 42 degrees Celsius this Saturday in Montreal. Whether in the stands or on the field, everyone needs to be prepared for this kind of heat. Hydration will be particularly important, but it'll also be vital for the players to dose their efforts and work as a team, a little like last week in Orlando. For yourselves, the supporters, a good way to fight the heat is to take advantage of our 2-for-1 on all drinks at the stadium from 5 to 6 p.m.